At 10 a.m. we arrived at the Kira Vehicle Plant in Jinja, a state-of-the-art car manufacturing facility. The company's CEO guided us through various sections of the plant, showcasing the intricate process involved in car fabrication. When we are doing vehicles, we are making, your, we are making it easier for humanity to move from one point to another on the road. This ginger plant will host the inaugural e-mobility expo this month, where Uganda will showcase the latest innovations in the electric transport subsector. This expo, the first of its kind, is expected to harness all the synergies of sector stakeholders in order to front the electric vehicle mobility agenda. We are sure about our product. We are now saying investors, please come, let's put hands together and build this fantastic business. Uh, this is not a factory that is just built for Uganda. It's a factory built for Africa. The purpose of this media tour is to provide journalists with exclusive information to ensure accurate reporting. The, the evolution to e-mobility is something exciting for everyone across the world. But as a journalist has the power to influence and also inform people, why wouldn't you be excited to report about something in your country? You know, media is very key in nation building. It's very good to keep media abreast with information. When you keep media abreast with information, they will be able to relay the rightful information to the people. Following the expo, the Kira Vehicle Plant is expected to be officially commissioned on the 8th of October this year as an independence gift to the nation. Wadulo Mark Arnold, UBC News.